Meta is testing new creator funding options. Adobe Premiere Pro just got a new auto color tool. Search Insights for YouTube is launching and more. This is the Creator Update. A new color correction tool in Adobe Premiere Pro is now available. Using auto color, creators can automatically apply color correction in their video clips. The tool, which is powered by Adobe's AI Sensi, is located at the top of the Lowmetry panel. The tool is particularly helpful for beginners and speeds up the color grading process for experienced creators as well. Meta is testing two new monetization options for creators within Horizon Worlds. The first option is selling virtual items like attachable accessories for your avatar or services such as paid access to special parts of your world. The second option is the Horizon World Creator Bonus Program. Participants must complete goal-oriented monthly programs, and at the end of the month, they get a payout for their progress towards that goal. Currently, both options are limited to testing with a handful of creators. Want to create cool effects for TikTok? Now is your chance with the launch of Effect House. Effect House allows users to build augmented reality camera effects for TikTok's videos and comes with a variety of tools and learning resources to create these effects for the community. Creators of the effects are credited with their name on the video's result page and under the effect name. In order to be approved for use, the created effects must follow the TikTok effect guidelines. The beta of Effect House is now open for everybody, meaning all TikTok users can experiment with creating and using these effects. Substack, the email newsletter platform for writers, released a new feature for cross-promotion called Recommendation. This feature is designed to help writers grow together and build trusted bonds across the platform. With recommendations, writers can approve the work of each other and show selected publications to new subscribers. When promoted, the writer will get a notification and an invitation to recommend back. Writers can also add a personal note, telling their readers why they should check out promoted publications. Substack Recommendations is now in beta and ready for testing. In an earlier episode, we talked about YouTube testing a new analytics tool for better content planning. That feature, Search Insights, is here. With Search Insights, creators are able to improve their content strategy by looking up what their audience is searching for. This relates to both the content of the creator's channel as well as more general search queries. The tool also highlights content gap queries, which are search terms that don't return a lot of matches, which can alert creators to new content opportunities. Search Insights is accessible in YouTube Studio by going to Analytics and then clicking the Research tab. Alrighty, that's it for this week. Hit that like button and make sure to subscribe for more interesting updates. See you next time. Bye. Wait, we still rolling?